All right, so this is a star 45 two to one purchase system details. The main sail dead ends here, goes through the block, comes forward to the ring, does a 180 and comes aft and out the boat. The jib sheet is at the aft end of this block, the becket comes through the, the eye, I mean through the block, right? and then goes forward and out the deck, but right now for display purposes, it's just hanging off the side with a weight on it. So as the block goes forward, the jib is coming in one-to-one. -one. As it passes the ring, now the main starts coming in two-to-one. So the main comes in. Now the main has now been picked up and the block is pulling the main two-to-one two forward, okay? The jib still is going one-to-one. This ring right, this bowsy right here adjusts the ring location. That bowsy goes from here to this eye and back to the ring. And then there's a black bungee that holds tension so the ring doesn't float around. So as you ease sails, so this is the fully eased position. The main is going out two to one. The jib is going out one to one. As it passes the ring, the main stops. And then the jib keeps easing out, easing out until the fully sheeted out position. So the, the trick here is, is that if you move the ring forward, the main sail's dead point, meaning where it stops sheeting, goes further aft. Meaning that the main does the main boom stops further aft. It doesn't go quite as far out. If the main boom I'm trying to make sure I got that right. And then the jib, do the jib twitcher. So the jib, that's jib trim. Okay. So the, so the, so the, when the, when the, if you move the ring forward this way to the left, the main stops sooner. If you move it aft, the main stops later. The trick of this is, is so that the main boom will stop just before the lower shroud.